Now, moving on, the United Nations Children's Fund has expressed worry over the worsening situation of child malnutrition in Nigeria. I called on the government to address it. UNICEF called on the government to scale up the implementation of preventive actions and also provide access to treatment of all forms of malnutrition. The United Nations Children's Fund made this call at a media dialogue in Port Harcourt, Real Estate, saying the current situation on malnutrition in Nigeria is alarming. Um, so where we are now in terms of malnutrition, the data that we have um, tells us that out of the approximately 35 million children we have in Nigeria, about 12 million children are stunted, while we have 3 million children who suffer from severe acute malnutrition. In terms of micronutrient deficiencies, one in two pregnant women is malnourished, while six out of 10, every 10 children suffer from anemia. All of these are worrying statistics because they have impact on well-being, productivity, exposure to illnesses, and consequently, it also can impact and contribute to, to deaths in population. And so the nutrition situation in the country now is one that requires urgent attention. And we also need to focus and see how we can implement preventive actions to prevent malnutrition from even happening in the first place. But then when we are unable to prevent, and in order to respond to the children and the populations who are currently suffering from malnutrition, put in place treatment and facilitate access to treatment of all forms of malnutrition so that we can have a healthier population that can contribute to our economic growth. The child of today is adult of tomorrow. If a child is well taken care of, that child grows to become a better human being. And a better human being makes, contributes his own quota to the growth of any nation. So that's it. So the main objective of our being here today and tomorrow is to discuss the issue of child malnutrition in Nigeria and to see how we can get governments and other stakeholders and DTBRs to increase funding for nutrition programming in Nigeria. Because the issues around nutrition is huge and the money available to tackle those issues are not enough. So we need to get more money into nutrition programming. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.